animal experiments gone wrong. For more than a century, mice, rats, dogs, primates, rabbits, and other animals have suffered in studies. Sensitive creatures imprisoned in labs have been burnt, shocked, poisoned, forcefully pregnated, beheaded, kept away in isolation from other members of their species, and subjected to many other horrors throughout the previous century. Every year, an estimated 115 million animals are used in brutal and antiquated experiments throughout the world, a figure that is nearly difficult to comprehend. Experimenters cut holes in the skulls of alligators, clone and castrate monkeys, and intentionally injure the insides of dogs' mouths in the name of science. Because the outcomes of these brutal tests are almost invariably unrelated to people, many of the diseases that experimenters claim to be studying remain without viable therapies or cures. As a result, human patients suffer as well. In this video, today, we are going to tell you some shocking few instances of operations that have been performed on animals. So watch till the end to know about these painful experiments. Experimenters drugged alligators and drilled holes into their skulls. In the United States, 40 alligators were imprisoned and ketamine drugged before experimenters cement-fixed head-restraining devices to their snouts, bore holes into their skulls, and connected electrodes to their brains. To sedate 40 American alligators from the Rockefeller Wildlife Refuge in Louisiana, the researchers injected them with both ketamine and dexmedetomidine. Ewan PK2 earphones with horns were inserted in the animal's earlids while they were sedated. The auditory brain responses to tones and clicks presented through headphones were recorded using electrodes placed on the alligator's heads. Despite huge variations in brain anatomy, the experiment found that alligators identify sounds using neural mapping mechanisms comparable to those of birds. But this is not how any sentient being should be treated. Monkeys were cloned and plagued with mental health problems. Chinese researchers genetically modified monkeys to cause mental health concerns such as anxiety, fear, sadness, behavior consistent with schizophrenia, and sleep difficulties, and then cloned them. The discoveries, according to researcher Chang Hong Chun, might contribute to the development of remedies for human medical illnesses ranging from diabetes and sleep disorders to neurodegenerative diseases and cancer. The researchers intend to breed a colony of monkeys that will be subjected to the most extreme types of psychological torment. Animal genetic manipulation and cloning will not address human medical issues, but will undoubtedly cause these clever, sensitive individuals to suffer for the rest of their lives. Experimenters pulled dogs' teeth out, cut their gums apart, and killed them. Despite international outrage, six Labrador retrievers were murdered in an experiment at Gothenburg University in Sweden to determine how dental implants induce inflammation and bone degeneration. Experimenters removed the teeth and chopped apart the gums of six black Labradors, Mimosa, Milia, Luna, Venus, Lotus, and Zuri, in a Swedish laboratory, presumably causing edema and bleeding. Venus, Mimosa, and Luna were murdered on February 26th, followed by Zuri, Lotus, and Milia the next day. The canines were all around two and a half years old. 35% of their natural teeth had been removed to make place for implants. The dogs were also put at danger of developing chronic discomfort due to nerve injury or infection. They were slaughtered and experimented on after the experiments, as if they were nothing more than test tubes with tails. Dogs' reception as man's best friend provides no protection from being imprisoned in laboratories and subjected to painful operations. Experimenters castrated monkeys and regrew their testicles. Five juvenile monkeys were castrated, their testicles were sliced into tiny pieces, and these organs were regrown on their backs in an attempt to create healthy sperm. It's as unnerving as it is nasty, and the monkeys weren't the only ones that suffered. Grady, the sole healthy monkey born from 138 fertilized eggs and branded the success story in this horror show, is a victim of cruel Franken-science. 
she'll most likely spend the remainder of her life in a laboratory, confined to a tight cage and exposed to painful, invasive operations. Monkeys are not small humans. Basic distinctions exist between our species, from DNA, cells, and tissues to reproductive biology, which frequently results in one disastrous failed experiment after another. Octopuses were given MDMA. Octopuses are not under-evolved humans, although some researchers appear to believe they are. A mother octopus and her eggs were collected from the sea so that researchers in the United States could test mental medicines on their children. The octopuses were kept in small tanks for seven months before being transferred to another facility and kept in buckets filled with artificial seawater. They were then forced to ingest MDMA, ecstasy, through their gills. The experimenter said that their bizarre study sets the groundwork for future testing of psychiatric medications on these sophisticated, intriguing marine critters. Despite the fact that animal experiments are frequently inaccurate and inapplicable to people, pregnant mothers force-fed Viagra-like pills. Viagra-like tablets, sildenafil, have been force-fed or injected into dogs, mice, rabbits, and lambs on several occasions. Even pregnant animals have been administered the medicine with the explicit purpose of creating pre-eclampsia. Their children were subsequently murdered and dissected, either before or shortly after birth. Another research found that sildenafil reduced the death rate of rat fetuses whose mothers had received the medication. However, animal experiment results do not transfer well to people. Experimenters provided sildenafil to pregnant women with underperforming placentas, informing them that the medicine may aid by boosting blood flow via the placenta and promoting fetal development in the womb. Tragically, 11 newborns perished as a result of the drug's lung complications. These catastrophic adverse effects were not expected by any of the animal experiments. So, a lot of the experiments using animals are unethical and wasteful and sometimes do produce misleading results because there is a fundamental biological and metabolic difference between species. Experimenters must switch to innovative, non-animal, human-relevant methods such as computer models that can accurately simulate what happens in humans, organs on chips, and three-dimensional human tissue cultures, in order to advance medicine and spare animals unconscionable cruelty. So that's the end of the video. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and press the notification bell so you never miss out on our next videos. Until the next video, take care.